hi clamsters and welcome back to my youtube video so without wasting any time let's get right into the video so today's video i will be showing you guys how to get a full face glam using affordable drugstore products so all the products will be listed in the description box down below and i believe all products are just below maybe a thousand rand so in terms of my eyebrow i did a procedure called microblading or ombre eyebrows so i did not draw my eyebrows for this video i just brushed them out and i went on and i used my Allegro pro concealer to just conceal them out and for this step it is very critical to use a flat brush once you are done with that you'd need a bigger brush to just kind of blend everything out and mesh it together so for the next step, I will be using my Ravelon foundation. This is the product that I used for my upper part of my eyebrows instead of using a concealer. And then I went on and applied foundation to the rest of my face. Those who started with me on YouTube know that I use a beauty blender. I did try using brushes um, the last few videos, but yeah, I don't think that is for me um yeah sponges just cut the time in half and it makes it easier to move the product around so i'm gonna move on and use my la girl pro concealer in beautiful bronze to just contour the rest of my face so i will be contouring my forehead my cheekbones uh my chin and my nose i just want to add on that all these products you can find them at your local pharmacies could be Discam or Clicks, whichever one you prefer. But in terms of the LA Girl um, products, they are only found in Discam. And honestly, I think I prefer buying my makeup um, at Discam over Clicks or or any other pharmacy for for that matter. So yeah, moving on, I am using my Beauty Blender again just to kind of blend the the rest of my face. Um, just take your time with this process. Uh, blending is is it's a very very critical part of makeup so moving right along i will be using my la gold pro concealer in the shade cool 10 this is slightly a bit more lighter than fawn fawn is the one that i used to do my eyebrows so with this one we want the highlight to to stand out a bit which is why i decided to go with the more bright so shade so i'm gonna apply that on my forehead my chin underneath my eyes uh, underneath my nose and the tip of my nose so moving right along we are going to blend the product out um, just take your time while blending guys just take your time and just switch up the sponge and try to use like a clean canvas or a clean slate don't use the contour the highlighter and the foundation all in, in, in one segment just you know switch it up and yeah you get what i'm saying so moving right along i'll be using my yagi and Ravelon uh, loose powder so i will mix the two together um, i don't know i think the the, the Ravelon banana powder is just a bit lighter and then with the yardly it's a warm cocoa so it, it balances out everything for me personally so i'm gonna apply that beneath my eye on my nose bridge and just below my cheekbone just to give it a more detailed structure and then i'm gonna let it sit for about five to ten minutes and then i'm gonna proceed and use my essence press powder just to remove the excess product so with this part you just want to do like a swipe and also just pressing in the product so we are going to go ahead and use the la girl pro concealer um i forgot the name of this shade but it is on my description box so i'm just gonna go and set all the parts that i had contoured which is my forehead my cheekbones underneath my chin just to give an illusion that we have a smaller chin guys and lastly i'm gonna um, use it on my to contour my nose i do take time with this process to get a snatched nose Lastly, I will not be using an eyeshadow, so I'm just going to go ahead with the same product and just kind of blend it on the crease of my eye just to give it depth and definition. So anyway, uh, we're just going to blend it out and move right along. 
I will be using my Passion Pro blush. Guys, when I tell you that the pigmentation on this blush is on steroids, it's, I give it a 10 out of 10. I OD'd when it came to this part. I packed it on, I packed it on, I packed it on. And please don't be alarmed. While I was filming this video, I was filming under a very, very bright or high resolution LED light and it became dark. So yeah, don't be alarmed. Trust the process. Everything came together. My makeup was flawless in the end and yeah there were no hash lines no flashbacks nothing nothing of that nature it came out perfectly perfectly so i am going to be using my la girl setting spray and when i tell you this smelled divine i went on and applied it again and again and again just to get that smell and that fragrance was everything and then i went on and used my essence o2 hot chocolate uh, eyebrow pencil so practically you can use this for your eyebrows but i prefer using it for my lips for like the last 10 years and yeah for my lips i am going to use i have no idea where i got this but i'm sure it was at the pharmacy probably 20 bucks this is just a neutral brown and i'm just gonna put it up there and that's just about it for the last step we are going to go ahead with our wow shimmer just to highlight our cheekbones um, underneath my eyebrows the tip of my nose and just a little bit on my nose bridge and i believe that's just about it thank you guys so so much for watching this video i wish that i did have a longer outro but yeah thank you for sticking around this look was perfect i am obsessed it was lovely and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.